We're playing bingo using Pokemon that you trade us. We announced a time and a link code, and we're just gonna receive whatever it is you all decide to send us. Shinies. That is on the board twice, considering previous evidence of our viewers' generosity to you. Flashback. Hey, they're trading me a shiny! They are trading me a shiny! Wow! No way! Whoa! Hey, another shiny! And a flashback. Mikey, here's the big question. When they see which one of us they're trading with, are they going to send various memes or are they gonna just send nice things regardless? There's a legitimate fear. <laughs> that I'm gonna get drowsy off the board immediately and then get nothing else the rest of the time. What if I lose because no one ever sends me drowsy? You ever think of that? That's called foreshadowing. I didn't think of that. Hi, right, Griffin. I only caught like one belly bolt and you get the belly bolt. I'm with Mr. Wolfos. Ooh, that's a powerful name. Hi, right, Griffin, what do you got? <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby, they're sending me a shiny. <laughs> You trampled all over my excitement over fish. Now I just, I feel like a fool. Oh, you're just getting a Magikarp? <laughs> not just a Magikarp, sir. Magikarp's not on the board, dude. I thought, I thought Magikarp would be on the board. <laughs> I put shiny on the board twice because I thought this might happen. Well, which one do I pick? I'm going to go for the one that's on the diagonal. I'm looking at the board, realizing that the second shiny probably replaced the space that would have been Magikarp. And I'm now questioning my own shiny finding action. No, what replaced Magikarp was Sandy Gas is because I've been getting drowned in the drowsy memes and I thought you should deal with the Sandy Gas memes. See, that's a double-edged sword of genius. 90% of our audience has no idea that's even a meme. I don't even remember what video it happened in. So I'm just gonna get sent Magikarp after Magikarp, but there it is, Froki, thank you. John? Yeah, what up? Tango is trading me a Maridon. What? I debated putting Legendary on the board, but then was like, oh, I feel like no one's actually gonna do that. So first I have Magikarp, which we took off the board, and then you you get a legendary, which was almost put on the board. That is absurd. I have multiple options for Maridon, I'm realizing. Because Maridon is base 530 plus, it's electric type, it's violet exclusive, it's JRM name. You're just stun locked, unable to figure it out. I feel like I need to go for base at total 530 plus because I feel like that would be the hardest to accomplish of the ones that it fulfills. Three for three for things that fit me were Krogunk next. Okay. This is gonna be an interesting day, isn't it? I can't believe I've started with a shiny and a Maridon, dude. Me either. <laughs> Uh, you and me both. Charmander. Hey, look at that. I'm going to make a frog tally. All right. I got Charmander from Luca, and I am going to cross off not in Dex, which is any Pokemon that does not have a Paldea Pokedex Dex entry. Wait. The, the shiny of my dreams, the shiny Meowth. Ooh, you could also pick Cat. I'm not picking Cat. All right. Charleaf 23. Grievered. Oh, a shiny Grievered. Y'all are too nice. And we should celebrate by subscribing to the channel. I know one of my big goals for this year is to get MJ TV plays to a million subscribers, and I can't get there without you. So if you're not already subscribed, you should double check and uh, subscribe, pretty please. We're four for four for things that go with me, and there's another shiny. Bang! Oh, there it is. There's the drowsy. 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 That, that's on the board, and I now have three of the six on the diagonal. We did not think of it. No one's gonna send me drowsy. John, as I received this drowsy, I wanna share with you a story. So, Katie, lovely editor Katie, let me borrow her uh, shiny Greninja to get a screenshot for a thumbnail. And when I was trading it back to her, oh, look at that! Rip sent over sub to Evan JTV. All right, they're forgiven. <laughs> When I was returning the Greninja to her, instead of giving me back the random Sunflora I sent her, she sent me a shiny drowsy that she had nicknamed Mikey. And I got this on camera because I wanted to get a shot of Greninja in the trade screen. <laughs> Mikey, it's uh, your, your, your devious ways are paying off. I've gotten my first Sandy Gast of the day. The meme I've created to counter the drowsy meme. Katie, would you please find what video it was in that he forgot what Sandy Gast was? Because I cannot remember and I don't want to look. <laughs> I sleep with drowsy. And now back to your regularly scheduled program. <laughs> It is I, Grunt Tip Boy, and Pop Quiz time. Ooh, yay, I love being right. Where am I? In my office. What am I doing here? Promoting a sponsor. And what is that sponsor? Well, it would have to be... 
Raid Shadow Legends, the super fun action RPG available on mobile and PC where you can collect and battle with over 700 unique champions. Impressive. What is your favorite thing about it? It's gotta be collecting really cool champions from all the different factions, then making them as powerful as I can. Wait, that's not really a quiz question. It's more of a survey. What's my favorite thing about it? The violence? The violence. Now, what is the AR event? A current event where new players can use their player ID at egghunt.plarium.com from April 14th to May 15th to hunt for dragon eggs and a chance to win amazing in-game items or real life prices like Amazon gift cards. And how can viewers download the game? New players can download Raid by scanning the QR code on screen or clicking the link in the description below. New players will get a free starter pack with all this cool in-game loot. Now for the final question, why did I quiz you like this? Uh, laziness? You didn't feel like doing the promo yourself? Wrong, it's because I have a mildly sore throat. Ta-ta! <coughs> Oh, a Fletchender. Okay. Ooh. That's middle Evo. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm actually sending someone a Tad Bulb and they don't have it in their decks and it's making me very happy to help them out and they're sending me a shiny Goldfin. <laughs> Look at that. That's Violet exclusive. Thank you for saying that. I would not have known that. Oh, look at that. A shiny Fluttermane from Vault. <laughs> All right, that is Paradox off the board for me. I could cross off Ghost type, but Paradox is definitely rarer. Oh, speaking of Paradox being very, very rare, Iron Jugulus. Thank you very much, Illusion. This person doesn't have Poltegeist in their decks. You know what? I caught one in a raid while I was catching Pokemon for this. I'll give them the Poltegeist. What a nice guy. Look, look at this guy. And they're trading me an Iron Valiant. Ooh. That is a Violet exclusive. That's where saying things out loud is very scary, because you said, I'm going to pick Paradox over Ghost. Paradox is rare, and then we got three in a row. Am I a buffoon? Yo! Oh, that's a really freaking cool Vavillon. I forgot that they added all the different forms in. Oh yeah, I haven't done that. Cause it like, there's that glitch run around where you can like delete your save file. Yeah, I don't want that to happen. That's a that's genuinely a really cool thing to get. I think that gets you flying type. Oh, let's go. Okay. Flying or bug or fully evolved three stage. I do think fully evolved three stage is the schmoove here. Interesting. Now I have three where over 300 pounds is. An unfortunate reminder to a past blunder. Flashback. Bear tick. That is an interesting one. What would bear tick possibly be though? Might be over 300 pounds. So you might want to look and see. That is interesting. I I feel like I'm gonna go ice type because I haven't seen any ice types and there's probably, you just we need a metal Pokemon for it to be really, really chunky. Editor's note. Bear Dick was in fact over 300 pounds and would have made it so John was one square away from winning. End of flashback. Oh, oh, John, I should have done ghost type. I'm getting another Iron Valiant. <laughs> Shiny Charizard? What? Wow, you're getting a shiny Charizard and I have had my first reception that I don't think gets anything off the board. Unless it's Italian. You don't believe in that country, come on. I do very much. It is, it is English. Ooh, not in the decks is the one for the Charizard. I'm gonna throw out what I'm putting there. I need to go check this thing out. Wait, Mikey, the Charizard is hashtag Team Sky. This was meant for you, but they just ended up with me and said, eh, this is my only chance. Go Team Sky! Zerua, <gasps> Hisui and Zerua, let's go! Oh, Ghost. That is Ghost and Regional Four More Convergent. And now I have another decision to make. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I have to cross off Ghost. Shiny Magikarp, it doesn't count for nothing, but come on, look at this guy. I do like that the name of the Shiny Magikarp is Shiny Fish, just, to, just in case I didn't know. Shiny Go Go! Oh, that's a good one. Is this anything? Oh, it's on Champion's team. On Champion's team refers to any Pokemon that are on Gita or Nimona's champion team. And Gita's gotta go, goat. It's called MNJ PM7. How lovely. Wait a minute, Flamigo. Little bit of a flying type, little bit of a bird. That's a lot of things. Also no Evo. Wait, if I do no Evo, thanks to the genius that is my friend Mikey, who is giving me too much help, then I have four in a row. Yikes. I need someone to send me a drowsy. <laughs> oh, but the Flamigo is named Love Your Vids, so that's filling my heart with happiness, so I'm okay in the short term. Bad in the long term. It's one of those cool Vivian forms. Hey, that's sick. I'm gonna go fully evolved three stage, because that helps me with the diagonal, the vertical, and the horizontal. Belly bolt. Another frog. I, I accept it and love it. Did you cross off electric yet? Not yet. I was excited about the frog. Panama. Mouse. Sure. Uh, 
I don't think that's anything. But it's a Pokemon. But what if it's Italian? Mikey, they're they're boycotting you. You need to accept this. <laughs> Crap. Ooh, Hisuian Zora. Oh, that's incredible. Thank you. Uh, regional four, more convergent. It's another four in a row. I don't have that many on the board to have two four in a row. So that's crazy. Oh, and there's there's the second drowsy. Woo! Hey, shiny Marini! That's such a good one. I know, it's very, very beautiful. Oh. All right, Marini. What are we putting you under, if anything? <gasps> Sprigatito! Oh my god, Mikey. What? If I get drowsy, I win. But I don't think there's a chance I get a drowsy. Oh my god. <laughs> is, is this where the meme comes back to bite me? Where your fans get revenge? I'm crossing off grass starter. That's another line where I have four. Dude, I can't believe this. All right, Aiden, what do you got for me? Wug Trio, the MVP. Wow, just a walking, talking W. How close does that get you? That's regional form or convergent. I've, I've already crossed that off. Don't worry. This is just this is just a reminder that no one has ever lost a battle with a Wug Trio. It's a walking W, Mikey. It's just it's important for people to know that. Wasn't there a John Michael Cup episode earlier this season where you had a Wug Trio on your team and lost to Gita? No, I didn't ring a bell. Guess I'm wrong. Ooh, Halucha. That is, I believe, bird. Oh, it's also flying type. Oh, it's also no Evo. <laughs> Shiny Sandy Ghast. Right, the Sandy Ghast, I think that'll finally be the old ghost type of Ruski, which doesn't help a ton because it's near Italian. I think I have to go for either flying or no Evo, and I think I'm going to go for no Evo because winning on a diagonal would be cool because we have yet to do that in this series. Ooh. I joining me in the one away, but I did get grass starter from Sprigatito. John, it just occurred to me that Magikarp earlier was J or M name and both of us missed it. Oh, that is a realization as I looked at the board a little bit more and I am excited to see the comments yelling. I'm getting a Sinistee. I am now wishing that I had used regional form for Zerula because this is now the ghost type. I just can't make the right choices. Shiny Pontiard, would you look at that? Oh, you love to see it. Its name is British T. <laughs> Wait, is new Evo like the entire line or the actual evolution? The entire line. Oh, that's new Evo. Oh, that is so huge. That means I only need over 300 pounds. Oh, because of King Gambit, of course. Yeah. This is getting close, dude. Atropius. <gasps> Flying type 14 sky. I am now one away in two different locations. Come on, Beth. I need the chonky Pokemon. Goldango is made of gold. Is there a chance? While you're checking that, I got Cerulege, which is split even. No, it's only 66 pounds. I'm a skinny legend. I thought it was over, man. Oh, BST 530. It might be that. It definitely is over 530. Yeah, 550. It was close. Okay. Oh, my. Oh my God, it's a shiny roaring moon. Shiny Heracross. Oh, that's such a good shiny. That's a cool one. I don't think I have bug either, which is kind of interesting this far in. No, I didn't have bug. Perfect. Oh, okay. Never mind. They changed. They ditched the roaring moon and now are sending me a shiny iron thorns. What? I don't know. <laughs> iron thorns is over 300 pounds, but it's also an electric type. I am getting another Zoro which is very, very cool, but I feel like I may have... Oh, communication error. Oh no, Olivia. Devastation nation. Oh no, we're still we're still there. Oh, okay. It was an error. I couldn't I couldn't take away the trade from Olivia just because it wouldn't cross anything off the board. That would be unjust. I gotta think about my decision here for iron thorns. Electric type makes more sense because that bottom row, all I have is drowsy. <laughs> yeah, uh, the bottom row's not doing anything. <laughs> hey, a Quaxly! Look at that. Quack. And that's also water starter. Shiny venom! Hey! It's a pretty shiny, and it's probably 300 pounds, right? The Quaxley's name is sub to PM7. <laughs> <laughs> that is a reg... Oh, oh, okay. Let me describe to you what just occurred. This person showed... It said Whooper, and I was like, oh, regional form. I've got it. Paldean Whooper, I've won. I was a Cantonian Whooper. Uh -huh. And then I was like, okay, is that anything? Because I've already crossed off not in decks. And then they backed out of that, and now they're sending me an Oinkalone. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I just need someone who wanted to send you a shiny drowsy, but then got matched up with little old me and it's like, eh, well, why not? Haley, chonky Pokemon or drowsy or a chonky drowsy? I wouldn't mind. Its name is Miss Piggy. It is also not th over 300 pounds. It's like 260. Mikey, I have a big question actually. Wait a minute. Does Raichu count for Pika clone? Yes, it's the entire Pikachu line. Yes, that's what I thought. Okay, that is something at least. Wait, what the heck? Anton, we got into a trade. We were about to trade and you just canceled. Watch, there's some random people who've never heard of us trying to trade right now. And they're like, I'll just use the exact same link code we did. And they're like, why can't we find each other? <laughs> that would be one of the funnier instances. I am getting Gimme Ghoul. Gimme Ghoul, Gabba Ghoul, Gimme Ghoul. Is, is Gimme Ghoul over 300 pounds? I, Cloth? I, I know that's wildly unlikely. Yeah, but what about Rock Crab? Is Rock Crab over 300? It might. Oh, Cloth. Cloth, you're not chunky enough. All right, what's Poke Girl 15 sending me? A ditto. Nice. I don't know if that's anything. Oh, no, it'd be no Evo, but I have crossed that off. The thing that I hate about this part is I'm all, I'm so worried now. Am I missing anything? Have I missed if something was like a different language or something? Yeah. Shiny Fluttermane. Oh, you're going to be negative five pounds, but you're very cool. Psych! No, they stopped trading with me. You're, they're not giving you the Fluttermane? No, they just quit. They're like, hey, here's the shiny. Bye-bye. Should I wait for you to get a new one? I found one immediately. I found Ferrograph. That's new Evo, but I think you already got that. Yes, but how? I mean, giraffes are huge, right? No, don't communication air. What do you mean? Wait, no, come on. No, because what if this is 300 pounds? While you're doing that, I'm getting Quaxly, which uh, is a bird. 350 pounds! What? The person who canceled the Fluttermane made it so I traded with Taylor Swift, who gave me the Forever Rig. Look what you made me do. Oh my God. Well, I didn't find a legit shiny, but this feels even better somehow. Wow. You know Katie's gonna figure out a way to Taylor Swift edit this at the end. Yeah.